Wondering how to negotiate a low interest rate on mortgages? The recent rise in interest rates have led many home buyers to ask this question. Rising rates have drastically impacted the housing market for both buyers and sellers. In this video, we'll cover five tips that can help home buyers learn how to negotiate a lower interest rate on a mortgage. In addition, we'll look at what sellers can do to successfully sell their homes and negate rising interest rates. This is Nathan Clark with your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty here in Rhode Island. In this video, I'll share five steps to help you negotiate a lower interest rate. If you'd like more real estate advice like this, check us out at NathanClarkTeam.com and don't forget to like and subscribe below. Now let's get into it. The first step to negotiating a low interest rate is to be prepared. Come prepared to talk to your lender. This means understanding your credit score, credit history, previous loans you've taken out, and other aspects of your financial history. Bring supporting documents with you if necessary. Ideally, the best time to negotiate is at a moment when you've built up a really strong credit score. Second is come to the table knowing what you want. Know what interest rates and loan terms you want. There are many types of mortgages and finding the right one for you will depend on the circumstances. For example, you can get a fixed rate mortgage or an adjustable rate mortgage. Make sure you do the calculations and consider what works best with your budget before negotiating. Third thing is start visiting lenders. Don't just visit one and be done. And that's what a lot of people do. Visit, visit several of them to get the best quotes. You know, when you're buying a house, you're buying two things. You're buying a mortgage and you're buying a house. The house, how long are you going to live there for? 5, 10, 20 years? Well, the mortgage is 30 years for most people. So just like you wouldn't walk into the first house and buy the first house that you walk into, you should do the same thing with your mortgages. You should shop the mortgage around so you can get a better comparison. You can use a broker mortgage uh, to give you help you compare other loan options out there, or you can go directly to a bank, credit union, mortgage company, or online lender yourself. We've done several videos about that on our YouTube page. Check us out, and you can look at the difference between those type of lenders. Number four, now compare the best offers. Compare all the quotes you've received. You shouldn't just look at the loans with the lowest interest rates. You also need to consider factors like overall cost, lender's fees, and annual percentage rate, or what you see is APR, to get a truly accurate idea of which offer is better. Finally, choose a lender negotiate once you've narrowed down your list. You can try negotiating for the best rate. You can look at uh, closing costs. Simply ask the lender if it's possible for you to get a better deal based on your financial history. Let them know if you've been quoted a lower rate from another lender. They might change their offer to match that. Other things worth mentioning are mortgage rate locks, a large down payment, or using discount points. All of these methods can put you in a better negotiating position and help you get a lower mortgage rate. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to get more information, feel free to call me at 401 232 7661. I'm Nathan Clark, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button below. Thanks for watching.